Good morning, YouTube. It's your boy. Oh, it's been a minute since I last vlogged, but yeah, currently it is four four thirty in the morning. I was actually supposed to wake up around six o'clock. That's my normal waking up time. But because I was so excited for this new challenge that I've set myself, as you can see, I've woken up at four thirty. Yes, so right now what I need to go do is obviously do my morning routine, brush my teeth, all that stuff, my morning prayers and everything, and then we're going to get right into the day. So, let's go. That's the heaviest I've weighed in a while whilst looking this lean. I'm not, I'm not lean lean, but the way I'm looking right now, compared to what I looked like when I was 103 before, it's totally different. So here we are in my room. As you can see, I've got a tea on deck. Just straight tea, no sugar, no sweetener, no nothing, just tea by itself. Ah, and now I'm about to do my morning routine, which is basically Obviously now I've got a reaction channel as well. Um, my other vlogging channel that I had, I turned that into a reaction channel. And that's been taking off quite rapidly, um, which was unexpected. However, that's what I do in the morning um, for my patrons. My patrons on Patreon, I do a couple of like live reactions of a TV show that they want me to watch. Um, right now I'm watching BT, we'll run BTS and i'm doing another show called black pink house um so that's what i'm gonna do first do that now whilst i'm sipping on my tea you know watch that show um i normally watch two episodes depending on the length and yeah that's what i'm gonna do now do another couple of reaction videos for my youtube channel and then i will head to the gym for around six o'clock that's normally the time I wake up, 6 o'clock, so now, right now I've got like an hour and a bit ahead of time, which is awesome. Um, I feel like I've rested enough. And again, yesterday I did sleep 10 hours, which is more than I ever do. So, yeah, that, that, that's probably why I've woken up. Um, what else? What else do I want to say? No, there's nothing else that I want to say. Oh, the reason why I weighed 303 kilos is simply because I was awake. Three, three hours ago <laughs> I wasn't I was it's not like I slept like a long time enough enough for my body to do all the rest in the need and now I, I was consuming food at like 12 o'clock so it makes sense that I'm 103 when I'm normally around 101.4 um, yeah I had two packets of noodles with four sausages at like 12 o'clock so <laughs> it makes sense that I weigh that much as I was like what, what why am I weighing this much I realized it was because I didn't eat like not that long ago. I'm acting like I slept forever, but I really didn't. But anyways, I'll catch you guys on the way to the gym once I'm done doing all this stuff. Cool? Cool. See you in a bit. Yeah, cool. There we are, on route gym. Um, I'm currently going to a gym that's like a couple stops away from my house. Um, normally, I would go to the gym just right across the road over there. Literally 10 seconds, but because I'm training chest and back and I prefer the machines at this gym, that's why I'm going there. Not because I just want to be extra and go to a different gym. I'm going there because I prefer the machines, especially for a chest and back workout and also the grip of the handles and stuff uh, for back machines and that, which you'll see when we get there, I'll show you guys. It's just way better and I prefer that one. So yeah, I still got to hit legs later on in the day. Um, as for my videos and that, I've recorded five videos done now there. Um, I'm like rendering them right now. So by the time I come back, they should be all completed and ready to edit and all that stuff and upload onto YouTube. Um, so there you go, six o'clock, I was supposed to wake up. Six o'clock, I'm heading to the gym, done with my videos. So I'm glad I woke up early. Uh, my train's coming real soon. That's why I'm kind of power walking right now. I'm like, but yeah, I'll see you guys at the gym. Never here yet. I'm running for no reason, fam. I was stressing for no reason. Another reason why I like this gym is because one, it's very quiet throughout the day. 
it's not just the morning that it's quiet it's literally throughout the whole day it's there's not many people in there there's a max of the busiest i've ever seen it maybe 10 people at max and that's the kind of gyms i like to train at i like to train at a gym where i don't have to wait for machines i can literally just choose whatever machine i want to use and use it without having to really think bruv like how many sets you got left and all that stuff so um, that's one reason why I train at 6 in the morning and that's another reason why I train at this gym because it's never busy and the gym across my road is actually not that busy as well in the morning in the mornings is mainly elderly people which is also awesome um, but it feels a bit weird dropping out my camera and whatnot recording even though they don't have a problem with it I've done it a few times um, but you know I just want to be I don't want to be putting people on blast early in the morning when they've got their morning faces and whatnot you know what I'm saying so yeah that's the other reason why I prefer training at this gym this train is taking long though, so two minutes from come on. So we made it here to Valbu. Um we'll call it Valby, 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 Val whatever you want to call it. Um weather's not looking it's looking alright. I feel like it's about to rain. Um, what did I want to say? I know some of you are probably thinking, okay, he didn't have breakfast, what's he doing? How is he gonna work out without having breakfast? Um, I'm not really one for breakfast. Breakfast is, I'm not a fan of it. It's not my thing. And I normally do my first workout fasted, not for any particular reason. Um, I just don't feel hungry in the mornings. Um, and I don't do all that pre work. Nah, my man's not walking underneath that, I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, I'll, I'll walk around them things there. I'll trust machines like that, bro. You mad? You mad? <laughs> It could never be me, I'm not walking underneath it. But my man's brave as well, I don't do hikes, but I'll be up there, just bare comfortable. Nah, I can't do them things. But yeah, um, like I was saying, I'm just not a big fan of breakfast and I don't feel hungry when I first when I first wake up. So I still feel like I got the food in me that I had earlier, but about midnight. So I'm gonna use that as my fuel. I haven't taken no pre-workout, none of that stuff. All I've drank is the tea, which has a little bit of caffeine in it. Um, and I should be all right for the next couple of hours. I'll probably break my fast around 10, 11, depending on if I'm hungry. It just depends if I'm hungry. If I'm hungry, I eat. If I'm not hungry, I no go eat. So, hello YouTube, welcome back to another commentary. As you can see, I'm starting off with a bit of skipping just to lubricate the joints to get my body warm. I could have done cardio, you know, incline but i decided to do skipping just to lubricate my shoulder joints and stuff and get me ready for this workout first exercise we did bed over rows i started off with just a bar of course and then i added a couple 20s i went up to 100 kg as my max and did that for like three working sets i then went on to a super set cable flies went pretty heavy really just focusing on a contraction and really stretching the pectoral muscles because I really want to get like, like the swoop and the width on my chest. I really want to get that development and the separation from chest to the shoulders. So that's why I decided to do flies early on in this workout. Um, normally I would leave flies to the end. But obviously since we're trying to uh, like make improvements in certain areas. You have to adapt and obviously focus on your weaker areas. And not just go by oh I've got to do like bench press first. I've got to do you know military press and stuff like that if that's not your weak points then it doesn't make sense to use all your strength in the beginning doing exercises that are not targeting your weak points to go and do exercises that you already developed if that makes any sense so then I went on to incline um, dumbbell as you can see really slow and focused and really contracting the pectoral muscles that's the focus just the contraction the stretch and really really engaging with the muscle we are working really squeezing i superseted this with close grip dumbbell press as well so just to add that extra stress um, but i chose a lighter weight i chose 20 kg dumbbells instead um, the ones i was using there were 25 so here just really i was already exhausted but now i'm just adding that extra stress to the chest and really causing it some damage um, I then went on to the final super set, which was these two amazing machines. This back machines, as you can see, look at my back, really stretching and engaging those lats. Um, I've recently just discovered this machine like 
like this no like in the middle of last week um and i've been abusing it ever since i really like it um it's a great machine because the handles can rotate so they can be like this neutral grip or you can make them like rotate to like 90, 45 degrees and really like engage the like outer lats and stuff like that and then you've got this close grip chest press really like this really just focus on squeeze 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 and that was pretty much it for the workout hopefully you guys enjoyed this commentary if you have any questions make sure to comment below and i will try my best to answer you guys enjoy the rest of the vlog so that's the workout complete i'm heading to netto right now it's literally across the road and i'm gonna go find me some spinach because we need that spinach yo for that breakfast you know what i'm saying so maybe we come in here Trains always come like eight, eight past, eight this, eight that. I see how long I've got until the next train. Right now it is 12 past. I've got six minutes until the next train. Cheers! And we made it. Yeah, 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 yeah. For a second there, I thought we weren't gonna make it, but we made it. Let's check in two minutes. It's not that far. You know, sometimes you think about it like six minutes, that's long, let's go walk faster than that. Nah, not even, let's go walk calm. Plan is go home, edit the videos that I did earlier, do that, and then um, do my thumbnails. And whilst that's all exporting and stuff, make my breakfast, go get that good man munching. I'm thinking high protein, moderate fat, low carb breakfast, that's what I normally like to eat. Um, and then obviously later on in the day I'll have my carbs and whatnot but right now I'm really on a, like a, a lower carb diet um, you know it's just the easiest way for a man to get shredded in it you know what I'm saying I will also be doing, planning my meals on the train journey home so that's when I'll go on my fitness pal putting all the meals I'll be eating for the day as well my train is here let's get it let's get it let's get it finished doing all the editing and everything thumbnails all that stuff's done now as you can see on the computer it is all exporting so whilst that's happening I'm gonna go get me some make me some good man breakfast and after the breakfast then i'll go have a shower and then come back start some drawing once these are done i'll upload them and everything um been a productive morning so far it's only it's around 10 o'clock right now 10 to 10 so i feel like i've done a lot already reaction videos done gym done i still gotta go back and hit legs later on but that's another stuff another time um but yeah for now we need that brekkie let's go make that brekkie i'll see you guys in a couple seconds so here we have it, breakfast is served. I'm about to yam down on this bad boy. Mmm, can't wait to eat this. The macros for this meal will be on the screen for you guys that are interested. Um, right now my calories are like 2,500 calories. Um, some of you probably forget that's a bit too low for someone like me. But then again, most of my day is spent in this chair. I don't move much. Aside from going to the gym, that's literally the only movement that I do. So for me to lose body fat, my calories have to be reduced higher than the average person that's my size that has like a physical job and everything so that's why it's very important to know what type of body type you have and what kind of person you are as well like if you're trying to compare yourself to someone that's very active always out their job is very physical and they're the same height as you and everything and you're like okay the calories they eat i need to eat that then you are mistaken because that's not how it works you know what i mean you gotta know your body type you gotta know the type of lifestyle you have as well it is very important in order to monitor your calories so that's why sometimes these calorie trackers they ain't the greatest thing to use um trial and error is probably the best thing to use like give yourself obviously use the apps um try multiple apps and if they all say like fairly the same rough number start probably with the highest obviously because you want to give yourself as much food as possible um try that out for like a week or so and if you are dropping body fat and dropping weight then you're in a good place if you're adding weight or increasing weight then obviously you need to reduce your calories um so that's the best way to go about it but yeah i'm hungry i'm about to eat this and i'll catch you guys later on what's good youtube so right now i'm making lunch i'm making some sweet potato fries and i'm making some hot wings um 
easy meal, ready tracked. So all I had to do was just, just weigh it, put it in the oven, bam, bam, bam. This is the thing about dieting. A lot of people get it misunderstood or whatnot. They're just like, it's just chicken, bucket and rice. No, 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 my friends, no, no, no. <laughs> I ain't about that life because I'm, I'm, and then again, it depends on the type, what's your goal in it. If you're trying to be like them 5% body fat and you're competing and stuff like that, then yes, your diet will eventually come to the whole chicken, broccoli and rice. But if you're like someone like me who just wants to love life, which is what I live by, enjoy life, be around anywhere between, let's say, 10 to 20% body fat, 10 to 20% body fat. I don't care. As long as I feel good, look good, I'm all right. You know what I'm saying? So for me, obviously right now I am cutting, I am tracking all my macros, but I'm not in a rush. That's the key there. I'm not in a rush. I'm not competing for anything. Um, of course, I have set, set myself like deadline goals and stuff like that, but I'm not in a rush. Like I've, Of course, I, there's a time where maybe, it's a maybe, I might compete. It's a maybe, maybe, but right now, no. I still got a lot of body parts that I feel like I need to develop. Um, but first, I want to reduce my body fat to the point where I can see everything, like, I can see everything and point out, okay, where it needs work and everything, and then go on a, like a lean bulk. Um, maybe for the next two, maybe three years on a lean bulk, um, just trying to put on as much muscle as I can. Um, I don't feel like I've reached my natural limit. Um, I feel like I can apply a lot more, um, especially like certain areas like lower back, shoulders, forearms, calves, legs. You know, I feel like I can develop these muscle groups a little bit more. I love doing what I love most, you know, um, and it obviously lets me do things like this, be able to train when I want to train. I can train twice a day if I want to. Um, and, you know, I don't take it for granted. But I do know that if I want to keep it this way, I'm going to have to work my ass off. I'm going to have to work hard, you know, harder than I worked when I had a part time job as well. Like I got to work hard if I want to maintain this type of life, you know. Um, and yeah, it takes work. But let me go see if my food is finished. It should be done by now because um, the hot wings normally are like pre-cooked so what they need is just a little bit of touchy touchy you know a little softy softy and that uh, the wings are looking good a taste of sweet potato fry though mm. hey sweet potato hey hey Sweet potato fries, I don't even even start with sweet potato fries. I love me them sweet potato fries. So here you have it. Hot wings, sweet potato fries. I've already eaten some of the sweet potato fries. Time for me to vacuum that. Oh, I finished the drawing as you can see right here. Came out pretty solid. I would be lying if I told you I wasn't leaning. I am leaning. I'm starting to feel it. I've, this task that I've set for myself is harder than I expected. Oh. But we're almost there. This is literally the final task, basically. This and obviously the vlog. Um, and then I'm done for the day. <sighs> right, and I still gotta go hit legs. I might have to adjust my training program, I'm not gonna lie to you. If I'm planning to do this, upload to four channels every single day and train twice a day, it's, it's no. <laughs> No. Only I'm editing this vlog as we speak, but it's time for me to go. It's time for me to go eat my dinner. It is made. Look who came to visit, big head. As you see, we've got our roast potatoes, we've got the chicken thighs, and we've got our broccoli on the side. Look at that goodness. I am filled. Is the lighting have to be on point? <laughs> Food looks uh, a success. <laughs> Food was a success. I'm slumped as a mother. I, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm tired. Leg, leg, day, leg is not happening. I've decided it's good that it's a Monday because I've decided I'm going to be doing chest and back, shoulders and arms, legs. Repeat that. Sunday's rest. Simple program. Wake up in the morning. 
maybe go do like 30 minutes of cardio incline chill you know relax read a book listen to some audio something come back body will heat it up then i can do my reaction videos and all that stuff in the morning yeah, tactical you gotta get tactical with this training to like man, for the four videos that i got upload one's exporting the other one i'm editing which is this one and it's 8 o'clock and I woke up at 4.30. Imagine, I woke up at 4.30 and I'm still not done. It's 8 o'clock. Man's been working. Chey! Man's been working how many hours? I've been working how long? 14. No, four, it's 8 o'clock. 14 hours. That's 16, my G. 4. 16. To 8. Wow, she's really counting in her hand. 16. 16 hours. That's what I've been rocking right now. And I'm not done yet. So I'm, I'm banging out them 18 hour work days. That's what I'm doing right now. <laughs> this is gonna be a tough road, but it's gonna be worth it. I can feel it. If I do this every day for the rest of the month, I'm not I'm gonna see changes. Um, but yeah, this is the last video to go up. So I'm gonna end the video right here. Um, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the day in the life of Musa, the boring Musa, I don't really do much. But actually I do, I don't do much, but I do a lot. You know, a lot of things that are leading towards the goal, you know what I mean? Which is the most important thing for me right now. Um, so yeah, it's worth it. I'm tired, but I'm mentally, I'm, I'm happy, if that makes sense. <laughs> oh, I'm going to sleep good tonight though. I know that for a fact. If I could, I'm going to caress that bed. Hey, that bed going to get good loving tonight. Trust me. Um... But yeah, I've been sipping on this the whole day. This is like two and a half liters. So I need to finish this. Maybe and obviously the workouts and everything. I drank water there as well. Um, I do have one more meal left, um, which I'll eat in like the next 40 minutes. It's just you. protein, powder, salted caramel with some yogurt and a bit of oats. And that's my final meal for the day. So again thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed the video smash the thumbs up new to the channel subscribe and i'll catch you guys tomorrow peace